Hey everybody, what's going on? Hello and boo. Happy Halloween season. I've got a Timu haul and it's in a gigantic box. So let, uh, and it's really heavy too. Holy cow, I'm getting strong. I'm getting strong with all these Timu orders. I don't even have room really. This Get over there. Now, first of all, we have some important things to talk about. And if you're new to my channel, hi, thank you for being new to my channel. We have a lot of fun here. Please consider subscribing. And thank you in advance for hitting the thumbs up button. If you feel so inclined, it really helps my channel. And thank you for your kind comments down below. There was a lot of discussion in my comments from yesterday's haul about whether this was a squirrel or a rabbit, well, because of the tail. Look, when I bought it, now we know Timu is not known for its accurate product descriptions, but it said Year of the Rabbit um, stuffed rabbit. And I think that I'm supposed, now look, and then I Googled today long-tailed rabbit. There is a long-tailed rabbit um, somewhere out there. So maybe except its tail looks kind of like this. I don't know, maybe it's a scrabbit, a squabbit, a squirrel and a rabbit hybrid, or I don't know, but wow, I've never seen so many people in my comments be like, it's a squirrel, but it's ears though, and it's face. It doesn't look like a squirrel and it's little rabbit paws. It's just the weird tail but we can smush it down and make it look like a small bunny tail if that makes everybody feel better there perfect all right there we go the rabbit second let's talk about the glitter all over my face i put i tried some of that glitter eyeshadow today and the worst thing is i dabbed it on while i was at the office and then i had to go in this kind of serious meeting with these people and when I got out, I was horrified to see, I saw I finally the meeting ended and I was just like, oh, that meeting was so intense and long and whatever. And then I happened to look in the mirror and I had glitter all over my face. It had fallen everywhere and I was so embarrassed. And I thought, oh my gosh, those people must have just thought I was a total glittered out weirdo in this meeting where we're all supposed to be serious. All right, should we get to what's in the box? It's two minutes and 52 seconds in, 55, 58. Look, the clock is ticking as we speak. Okay, what is this? Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff in there. Buckle up. Okay. Do we even have room to move around? We will eventually when this thing gets lighter. Okay, let's see what in the world this could possibly be. Oh my word, you guys. I, I'm a little bit T-mood out. I've heard stories of, for instance, kids whose parents caught them smoking. And as punishment, the parents made them smoke like a ton of cigarettes. Like... 20 or something one after the other until the kid threw up now these were back in the days of the 70s when you know punishments were a little more <laughs> i don't know we got spanked when i was a kid uh, but anyway so parents made them smoke cigarettes until they threw up and then they never wanted to smoke again that's kind of how I feel about Timu. Like, I've had so much Timu lately during the past few days that I am kind of getting all Timu'd out. I got a new sign. That's what this is. Oh, wait. Oh. Hot coffee. Now, hold up a minute. Let me see what's going on with this thing. I think I hear a little clover. Well, I think what I hear is Clover and Loki fighting, which I don't like to hear. Um, I might get another little girl kitten, believe it or not, for Loki to play with. Well, for both of them to play, you know, with each other, two little kittens. 
and then maybe they'll all leave poor Clover alone. Oh, okay, in this box that I'm looking at, there are just little things to, I guess, hang it up with. I don't know how these things work. Stars. Here's a little replacement light bulb. Okay, put that right there. I hate it when they come with all these things. So, hot coffee, that's a fun sign. It does require batteries. I don't have any right next to me. Why don't I ever bring a ton of batteries with me when I do these hauls? That would be a smart thing to do. Then when something requires batteries, I could just pop it open, put the batteries in, and we could check it out. But let's put this on the list of hot coffee. Now, wait, is that a Z shop? It's supposed to say hot coffee shop. I guess it's an S. Oh, it's a Z from how I'm looking at it on the monitor because it's backwards. Okay, never mind. I'm not, sometimes I'm a little dyslexic, but on my monitor, everything is backwards. So that's why I get confused sometimes. But this is cool. It looks like an old school diner sign and um, me and all my backdrop signs. Just wait till I change the tapestry behind me. I don't know. I'm really attached to that tapestry, but I feel like if I'm going to film here every day, I should mix it up a little bit and change tapestries behind me. Okay, notice that I have to practically climb in here to get... Oh, what did I pay for that? Here we go. Here we go. What did she pay for that? I'm just going to see if I can see it really quickly somewhere, and if I can't, I can't. Now, this is from an order way, way, way a long time ago. I've had this some of this stuff sitting around for a while. And this phone is being a little contrary. And, oh no, it's time to feed my fish. Oh well, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. No, just fish. I'm never, ever, ever going to play Fishland again, and I'm never playing this particular... I don't think I'm ever going to finish this particular game of Fishland, unless I drop like $10,000 or something, which is ridiculous. I could just buy the prizes. This hot coffee sign was... $21.28, and I got a partial... A, price adjustment but now it's 20 now it's $21.29 and it's cool it would look cute in a kitchen I need it let's hydrate we've only been talking for seven eight minutes I wish that were vodka not gonna lie it's been a day but Wednesdays are my favorite days, you guys, because we, well, besides Fridays, because we get out at four o'clock. Okay, I got these Irish, um, they say, slanche, slanche, slanche. I, somebody in Ireland correct my pronunciation. I know it's a ch on the end, right? These are for my brothers. I got one, this one must be for my youngest brother because he wears a medium and um my other brother though has got several several six packs of beers in his stomach make that cases of beers in his stomach and he wear he swears he wears an xl but i say he wears a 2xl Okay, I think this is another one. I think this is the other. Why did they roll it up and cram it in here like that? Ew, I hope this wasn't a return. Because this looks like the way I fold things. With the KonMari roll. I don't know. It's got a piece of tissue paper in it. It feels like bad material. It feels really bad. I'm disappointed. It does not feel like soft t-shirt material. And... These are part of their Christmas presents. They get like an Irish theme and then they get like a steampunk theme. Well, no, my brother, my one brother gets an Irish stuff and retro stuff. 
And then my other brother gets Irish stuff and um, steampunk stuff. But I can find these. These t-shirts were about seven bucks each, like they always are. I'm kind of curious to know what I paid for those. And I know they're right here somewhere with all the Irish stuff. There's like a whole order of Irish stuff. Stuff. <laughs> oh, Lordy. My mouth is tired from talking already. Here comes Loki. Here comes Loki. Everybody run for your lives. Loki, no. Loki, there's an earthquake. That's the earthquake. He came in like a wrecking ball. Okay, $10.25 is what I paid for those. And they're still $10.25. That is expensive for a Timu t-shirt, you guys. Wow. I can't believe that. Okay, now I need to get some things out of this. Can you not? Look. Okay, this is a little Christmas countdown thing. Let's get it out. I'm ready for holidays. It's so hot outside, you guys. It's hard to get into the October spirit, and it's already going to be October 5th. Um, tomorrow. It's going by. It's going by. It's going by so fast. Today was the two-year anniversary at my current job. I have stuck it out there for two years. Plan on being there about eight more. Get those retirement benefits. Okay, this is a little Christmas tree and it comes with little wooden ornaments that you hang on it, which is really cute. It's got two bat and it comes with a little star that you stick on top and some more little ornaments. And then underneath there are the blocks. Oh, wow. You can even change this block to, oh, 85. So you change it to <gasps> the claws. You change it to how many days there are until Christmas, right? Or no? Can I just make it today's date? Because I don't know how many days there are. I'm not one of those people that knows how many days there are until Christmas left. Loki, ugh. He does come in like a wrecking ball. That song was written for him. You came in like a wrecking ball. Where's a four? I'm looking for a four and there is no four on this thing. Oh, well. So you can even take this thing and put it in, put it on October, this block. So it's October I, I, oh, I have a great idea. Maybe there's a four right here. Okay, there's a four. Look, I'm just going to, right now I'm just going to put the date on it. Because I don't know how many days there are until Christmas. I'll have to look it up. There, there's today's date. Which is really not what you're supposed to use this for. This is supposed to be a countdown to Christmas. But that's nifty. You can even, there's more blocks under here. So, they all just fell out, but they've got all the months of the year on them. You could even start using this all the way in January if you wanted to be obnoxious like that and be like, there's only 364 days until Christmas or whatever. Have your family and friends kind of hate your guts and tell you to stop it. Go back to Christmas Town where you belong. Okay, I'm gonna put this in it back in its little box because I didn't realize it had all these little ornaments. But that is just precious, you guys. Let me see if it's still available or if it's sold out. And I knew you can. I know you can get them in other little formats too. I picked the Christmas tree one, but there were other options. Here it is, right here. So it was five dollars and forty nine cents. Now it's five seventeen. And see, you can get a bunch of different ones 
You can get ones with like Santa on it or a reindeer or a white Christmas tree or I got the green Christmas tree that I don't even see here anymore. But they're cute. Here's the green one. Anyway, they're it's cute. Five seventeen. I paid five forty nine, but I did get a price adjustment on it. Should I turn down this light a little bit? Let's get some soothing. Is that working? No. Oh, okay, much better. Okay, he came in like a wrecking ball. Here he is again. Here he is again. Everybody run for your lives. Okay, the next thing in here is a crinkled up mermaid tattoo that I don't know where I'm going to put. If I'm going to put it on at all on my arm, on my inner arm. I don't know, but it's all crinkled up. So will it even go on correctly if it's all I'll have to flatten it under a heavy book or something um ow those claws have got to get trimmed I either have to have someone teach me how to do it I'm just too scared to trim his claws I'm scared I'm gonna trim them too far down okay here's something Oh, that tattoo was free. Um, if you go to, oh my gosh, what is it? Rewards. If you search for reward 777, I think. I learned this on Cheryl's channel. Are we there yet? And um, let me look really quickly. I can look in my search history and tell you how to get free, a free um gift. It is, come on. Okay. It's reward seven, seven, seven. If you search for that, you can get all kinds of discounts, coupons, um, bonuses, and all of that. Um, on that page, it's really trippy. Like I didn't know it even existed until I learned about it on Cheryl. Are we there yet? Let me just grab my, um, as long as I'm here, wait, where's my meal time reward starts in 48 minutes. Oh, okay. All right. So it's reward seven, seven, seven. Just put that in your search bar. And why do I feel like this is another purse? It's like, I never want to see another purse again. But today I got my Timu Influencer order, so I'll have to do that. And I'll make sure not to combine it with another product review this time. Maybe it'll get accepted. But I also got an email from a lady at Timu saying, Why aren't I promoting some of my products in my... Like, I have, like, an influencer list on Timu. Like, if you put my code in the search bar, I think it comes up with my influencer list of products. I don't know. But she's like, you should be promoting those so you can get commission on them. And I'm like, I don't care about getting commission. I want people to find stuff they like. I got this for my mom. It's another attempt. I'm going to try two times. Her other purse was blue. The one that fell apart. This one is like a blue green. I don't know. It's fairly simple. Why is this all covered up with styrofoam? It's snazzy enough to be covered up with... What is happening here? I don't know. I don't know what this is doing. It's, I mean, it's covered up with, I don't want to uncover too much because I'm going to give it to her, but it, oh, she's going to hate this. It fastens like this and then you unzip it. That's a lot of work. What does the inside look like? Just a lot of just some slip pockets and your standard zippered pocket. But 
this is ni a nice ba bag. I mean, I'd use it. And if my kid, if I had a kid and my kid gave it to me, I'd act like I loved it. But who knows? We've got this one. We've got the brown braided one. And I don't know. The purse that she loved and lost was, not lost, but the one that got all chewed up was from Talbot's. And it was a little blue clutch. And I don't know how she ran around with that thing. I mean, it had a little wristlet strap on it, too. But I... I don't know. She always had it crammed to the max. And I don't know how much. I think that purse was fairly expensive. In fact, I think it might be real leather. Because I didn't want to get anything cheap. I'm going to find it. But anyway, that mermaid tattoo was a reward 777 free. Like if you place an order, you just get a free. You get to pick a free gift and that's what that was for a minute it felt like something was crawling on my head all right just let me see if i can find it here comes loki again lord help us all hi loki why don't you take a nice nap nap time Time for naps. I might not be able to find it. Or you know what'll happen? I'll find it sooner or later. It's definitely not there. She came in like a wrecking ball. Um, I don't know, you guys. Also during that meeting today, one of my pens... The pen I was using broke open and ink just started to get everywhere, all over my notebook. Here it is, all over my hands, all over everything. I was a mess in that meeting today. It cost $46.29 and it is leather hobo bag, real leather. It's now sold out, at least this color in blue, but you can get it in. Let me smell it. Yeah, it smells like real leather. Um, you can get it in black, which is classy. You can get it in like a taupe. This color. And then the blue that I showed you is sold out. And wait, what is it now? Fifty-one forty-eight now. Holy cow, Timu. Raise your prices next time. All right, next in here, there's a box. Oh, Lord, it's going to be something in styrofoam again. Our favorite. Right, Loki? Oh, he's falling asleep. Ooh, it's starting to get dark outside, and it's only 516. Those... Nights, fall is coming. I don't like it when it starts getting dark at five because then you start feeling kind of run down at work, you know, when the sun starts going down at about 4.30 or whatever and you really feel like you should be going home but you still got, you know, a half an hour left at work. I don't know. I don't really have anything exciting to talk about. Meetings glitter on my face. I came home for lunch. I took a nap during lunch. I was too tired to do a lunchtime quickie video. It's a box within a box. And this, I like this kind of styrofoam. Now I can live with this foam. Okay, I think I know what this is. Christmas box. Oh, Christmas box. Now I just have to figure out how to open it. Oh my gosh. What a surprise. It's another mug. But it is a nutcracker mug. 
Ah, that's fabulous. Oh, look. Mary Square. It's actually got a do not microwave, hand wash only. Oh, no. I hate hand wash only. I'm putting it in the dishwasher. No, oh, maybe it's hand painted. It's really cute, isn't it? Yay, I love that. And that I paid $8.74 for that, and it is now $9.44. Wow, Timu's having a big day today of just really raising its prices on everything. All right, let me put it in the garbage bag. Now I have to sneak that, that mug downstairs and be like, Mom, we've always had that mug. Because she's like, if you buy one more mug, I'm throwing you and all your mugs out on the street. This is another shirt for my brother. <laughs> I just got him like every shirt they had, I think, because I didn't know. But look how cool and retro this one is. It's got that cool retro 50s kind of vibe. I don't know about the color, but, and it's 1XL. Yeah, it should fit him. I don't know how I'm going to gift these to him. Just put them all in one big gift bag and go pick a shirt, any shirt. And if you don't like, oh, in the middle of the night at about one in the morning, I couldn't sleep. And I woke up and I thought it was time to go to work. And it was really just one in the morning. And I ended up getting on the vet's... Um, I think it was the uh, Association of Vietnam Vets, and I got on there. They come around with a truck if you schedule it, and I got on their list for next Thursday to come pick up donations, so yay. Um, these are more cow sheets and pillowcases, so cow print. So now I have two sets because I like them, but it only comes with a... Uh, fitted sheet and two pillowcases. It's all European and stuff. It doesn't come with a top sheet, which is kind of a drag, but I'll just put on something else as a top sheet. And so that cost those sheets, in case you're wondering, and they're super soft. I know that's why I ordered them again. I have confidence in those and they are, here they are. Sheet set, 1509 and they are now, that's what I paid, but they are now 1279 Hey, where's my price adjustment, Timu? I don't have a price adjustment. Wow, I went nuts with this order with cow stuff. Here is that same shirt we just looked at, and I got it twice, and I got it in another size I think does that say this just says XL and the other one says 1XL so I don't know if he hates it he'll hate both sizes but if he likes it I got myself a baseball cap because I don't have any I don't have enough baseball can you ever have too many baseball caps? This is a shamrock for St. Patrick's Day. Look, I'm already thinking way, way, way ahead to other holidays. It's tight. Well, that just looks lovely. No, it just needs to be loosened up. He came in like a wrecking ball. What are you doing? Now my hair's all messed up. Not that it was perfect before, but it's a cute cap. If I throw it, can I make it onto my cap holder? I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna try. Nope, I throw like a girl. No, don't go get it. We're not playing. That wasn't a mouse. Uh, Loki thought that was a, 
Loki thought he was supposed to go get that. I shouldn't have thrown that. What was I thinking? Okay, I see some fingernails. Wow. Here are... I need my glasses. I can't even tell. What, uh, what is the... Oh, the box. I'm like, what is that brown thing behind me? Why are these all dirty? Hold on, let me clean my glasses. Give me a minute to clean my glasses. Okay, nails. These are little black spark, stop it. Black sparkly cat eye nails. One of them, hopefully one of them just kind of fell out and is not missing. Do it yourself. Yay. Some Halloween nails. All right. What I have to do is get all my Halloween nails together. And I have to take off these nails. Which so, I, I, I love these nails. And I don't want to take them off. These are Olive and June. And our Target does not have press on Olive and June. It just has the... The nail polish but our walgreens have olive in june but they're really expensive i mean they're not really well yeah i mean they're 11.95 they're expensive if you consider that we've been paying like a dollar 74 or whatever for some nails on timu then suddenly like the press on nails at walgreens um seem really expensive and I haven't checked Walmart yet. I haven't been to Walmart in a hot minute. Okay, I, this was cute. I got this for our Christmas tree or I got it for my mom because she loves um, It's a Wonderful Life. Well, we all love It's a Who doesn't love It's a Wonderful Life? And it is the bell that rings when an angel gets it, its wings. So it's the bell it's a bell, and it's got a wing on it, and it says, what does it say? It says, it's a wonderful life. Well, you can't, really? Try turning it. There, it's a wonderful life. You can kind of see it. And then, yeah, it's got an angel wing, and Loki wants to ring it. All right, an angel just got its wings, and it you tie it on your Christmas tree. Oh, Lord. He's going to run off with that, and then I'm never going to see it again. No, no, no. Too many angels getting their wings. No, Loki can ring a bell. I don't know what I paid for it. It's really cute. Let me see if it's sold out or if they still have it. I think this is a cute gift, too. You know what would be a cute gift to give this to someone with the movie on Blu-ray or DVD or whatever people choose? I don't know. Does anyone still watch DVDs, if not Blu-ray? Do they have It's a Wonderful Life on Blu-ray? I'm sure they do. Okay, let me see if I can find that because I want to know if it's still around. And I, now I kind of want to get that as my, what do you call it? Dirty Santa gift i think i want to get it's a wonderful life with the bell no one's gonna want that gift nobody ever wants my dirty santa gift so i'm gonna get something that i want for myself i'm gonna get a big bottle of baileys as my dirty santa gift at the office this year and if nobody wants it i'm taking it back All right i'm still looking for that bell look i've been looking at that bell I know what I can do. I can search my orders for Bell. Do you hear Loki purring? Loki, are you purring? He's purring. Okay, let me look in the Ireland order. There it is. The baseball cap was three eighty seven and it is now out of stock. That stinks sold out. The angel wing wind chime was two forty one and it's now two nineteen and I did get a price adjustment on that. 
And here's a better picture of kind of what it looks like without the glare and all of that. So cool. He's sleepy. I don't know where Clover is. I, she must be under a chair or I, I don't know. I, I've been calling her and I don't know where she is. She must be asleep. I got this for Halloween. Let's switch holidays for a minute. This is the shirt that I did not get in my influencer bag that they just left out for some reason and it is like a Halloween blouse and it says trick or treat. It's got some skulls. It's got a, a planchette on it. It's got more skulls. It's got a jack-o'-lantern. It has some moths and bugs and the back looks like this and some black cats and very cool. I can't wait to wear that. That shirt, I just saw it. It was, here it is. That shirt was, I paid $8.49 and it is still $8.49. And the cat is licking me. It goes up to a size XXL. Okay. It's 5.30 p.m. This is a laundry bath, laundry hamper with cow print. Oh, I haven't posed for anything for a thumbnail. My thumbnails are kind of lame. Hey, everybody. Cheese. Oh, wait. I took a thumbnail before this video of me getting crushed by the Tinu box. But just in case, I'm going to smile for this one. Hello. Okay. Put that there. We can never have enough laundry hampers in this house. Always doing laundry, mine and my mom's. So here you have it, a gigantic cow print laundry basket. And if I'm not using it for laundry, I'm sure the cat will get in it. And have a, yep, there he goes. He's gonna get right down there and get in that thing. He looks excited just looking at him. He was all sleepy and now suddenly he's like, oh, okay, that was $5.98 and it's still $5.98 and you can get it in. The cow print is sold out, but you can get it in pink leopard print, which is cute. Or blue leopard print, which is really cute for $5.98. I'll try to link to my orders in the description below. Next, we have something in a box like this. What could it be? Oh, cool. Now hold up. It's another little ghosty glass. And I'm all about the glasses with lids these days because then little fruit flies can't get in my drink. It's precious, you guys. I like this better than the color changing one from Walmart. But that's really adorable. I love that. I love it so much. Smile, smile for my thumbnail. Boot, get the other ghost in there too. Pull, what is this doing? What is it doing? Litter on my face. Okay. Cheese. I just look like I'm clenching my teeth about to bite somebody when I say cheese. Salami. All right, I don't know. 
put it carefully right there with the other glassware. And that cost, I just saw it with the shirt. There it is. Whoop, there it is. I paid $6.20 for it and it is now $6.29. And it's very cute. It comes with a straw, a little glass or yeah, glass straw. Kai White. Kai Kawaii. I don't know how you say it. Ghost. No, feel it. I mean Loki. 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 No, Loki. Okay, that was a bad idea. Loki, no. Get all the breakable things away from each other, actually. Can't do anything practically here. No, Loki. I'm sorry, you guys. Here, come say hi to your friends. Don't bite. Say hello, friends. Okay, he's biting. He's biting. He's scratching. He's climbing. Here, you want to get down? Why don't you get in this laundry basket? See how you like this thing right here. Okay. Here's another shirt <laughs> for my brother. I'm not even going to take it out. I'm so sick of looking at these shirts. How many does that make? 12? I've gotten him like 12 of them, I think. I'm going to have to narrow it down. Here's another one of these stupid things. Don't get me started on these things. Now, look, I like that Santa Claus a lot, but I'm tired of these little round cardboard things. I'm just sick of them. They're dumb, and they I thought they were raised, like 3D raised. I didn't know, and then... Now I've got like 8,000 of those round cardboard circles. Here he comes. Hello, why don't you lay down and go to sleep? Sleeping time. Sleeping time. Time for little cats to sleep. Okay, close your little cat eyes and go to sleep. Um, I have no idea where it is, you guys. I, it was probably about five bucks with my luck which is a lot to pay for that piece of cardboard with Santa printed on it. Here he is. Santa Claus is coming to town. $3.99 and it's now $3.59. Santa Suncatcher. Really? It doesn't look like a sun catcher to me. Oh, maybe this is a sun catcher. Okay, well, that get, that redeems it a little bit. Yeah, I thought it was one of those just yet another plastic, I mean, cardboard circle. But, okay, we're in the Christmas spirit now. Here's some cow pens. Yay, I'm going to put them in my cow print purse. Where is my cow print purse? We're done, I think, with cow print now for the rest of our lives. We've got enough cow print everything. I just went all in with the cow print. I'm all in with the cow print. What time is it? 43 minutes? Holy cow. Are we even halfway through the box? All right, where's the all cow print order? I just want to know what I paid for those pens. I'm curious. There they are. I paid $162 and they are now $198. And then while we're on that, let me just keep getting cow print. This is a cow print flannel blanket that I got in a size... I don't know. 63 inch by 83 inch. Holy cow. That seems like a lot of inches. And it's shrink wrapped. Do I want to open it? Or... I'll open it just to hear it go. <laughs> Moo! All 
light. It's big. Cool. It's huge. Okay, cover them up. Cover up the little kitty. <laughs> I put it on the cat. Okay, awesome. I think that's it for the cow print stuff. I know people are crushed. The flannel blanket, I paid $19.48 for that. I got a discount. And now it is... 1947, so I got a penny back, I think. Wow. Okay, the next thing in here is... Oh, we're almost done. Oh. It's a plushie. I think. Wait. It's a ghost. What is happening here with a pumpkin? Oh, it goes like this and you fold it around to make it look like it's holding a brown. All right, I don't know, you guys. This is really lame. It's a ghost plushy. It's supposed to be holding a pumpkin, and you guys know I might cut this pumpkin off. And just well, then it's really strange. Now, let me show you the picture. It goes like this. Now, if it fastened or something, why didn't they make this orange? I'm disappointed. I'm not gonna lie. I had high hopes for this ghost plushie. Right, Loki? We both were looking forward to that. Um, the ghost plushie. Now, let me look. I gotta find it. I gotta find it. And I gotta find the picture of it. And I have to look to see what it's supposed to be trying to do. No, don't touch my phone, little boy. Here it is. All right. What did I pay for that? Eighteen forty-seven. <gasps> Here is the picture. Here's a picture of it. See, it looks like it's holding a pumpkin, and that pumpkin looks orange, not brown. Maybe it's my color blindness that's making it look brown. I don't know. But how do you get it to hold? That's interesting, is all I'm going to say. And it's now $17.98. Did I get a price adjustment? Yes, I did. All right. Are we almost done? I got a big pack of fluffy socks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven pairs of fluffy socks. Yay, I want to put those on my feet right now. I don't know how much I don't know how much those cost and I don't know where they are you guys I don't know I don't even recall seeing them in any of these things as I've been scrolling around usually by now I've scrolled up and down so much that I kind of have a feeling for where everything is but now not so much maybe they're in oops Maybe they're in this. Yes, they are in this. I paid seven pairs of socks, $6.07, and, and they are still $6.07 if you live in the States. Then there is this journal kit. It's supposed to come with all this stuff. Oh my. It comes with a lot of little extra. It's 
really for kids. Maybe I'll give it to my... Okay, it comes with the paper and... I am not going to open it. I'm sorry, you guys. It just comes with a bunch of little props and I believe stickers. And there are some tabs in here, it looks like. And it's a cute gift to give, like, a kid. Like, maybe my niece, my youngest niece would like it. I think it was one of those spin the wheel deals. Because otherwise, I don't... Or maybe a re reward 777 deal. Don't forget to search for reward 777. 1047 is how much it costs. And here's kind of an example of what they did with... Well, of what they did with it. Like, stuck a bunch of stickers, hung the horse and the pom-poms in it, and... I don't even know. It says D do it yourself. Lined journal, sketchbook, pocket planner, girls diary, cute notepad, stationery, notebooks, journals. 1047. Hmm. I don't know. I thought it would be bigger. I don't know what this is. I think it might be a bumper sticker. I get nervous when it's dark outside. Well, not when it's dark outside. When it's turning dark, you know? Like when the sun goes down and it goes from sunny to dark. Which is usually what happens when the sun goes down. I get nervous and anxious. Then once it's dark, I'm fine. It's just that transition. Maybe this is another tattoo. I don't know what this is. Um, yeah, I got my Timu Influencer package today. Oh, this is another one of those thank you for all you do mailbox stickers. Because I don't know. How, don't I already have three of those? Okay. Thank you for all you do. This is for my brother's car. It's in Ireland. One of those things you stick on your car and it's Ireland. My youngest brother. And then along those lines of Ireland, here is a map on a tin thing. And did the tin thing get bent? A little bit. It's all right. Cool. There's Dublin, Galway, Cork. Really cool. I like it. This is for his bar, for him to hang up in his bar. He's got a bar downstairs in his basement in his man cave. What in the world? A smashed box. Smash box. Now, somebody in comments told me they know the artist who makes these little witches. And that this was stolen, like a stolen sculpt from that artist. And I feel very bad about this now. But here's another one of those witches to complete my collection of, I guess, black market witches now. Oops. Shame on that Timu seller. And I don't know what I paid for that. Or where it is, for that matter. I've seen it. I've seen it a few times scrolling around. Stop it. It wants to move the whole page. Instead of just the scrolly thing. Oh, well, I don't know what it is. I'm going to say I probably spent 
what did I spend on the last ones? Like 10 bucks on it or something? Now this is, but now the curiosity is, there it is. I paid $5.39 for it. I was way off. And it's still $5.39. Okay. We are almost done with this box. There are three more things in it from what I can see. And they are earrings. Yay. Then I get to clean all this stuff up. I still have two big bags out there and some small boxes. What in the world? Okay. These are cute. They are little um, flowers hanging from hoops. Oh, these earrings are Betsy Johnson. I got at TJ Maxx and this sweater I got on Amazon. I'm wearing actually nothing from Timu today. Oh, I wore Timu shoes. I wore those ballet flats, black ballet flats. And I'm wearing a red um, skirt that I got on Amazon too. So before there was Timu, there was Amazon. Try before you buy clothes. Here's some more earrings that are de delicate little stars that you actually clip through your earlobes and they hang down like this. I'm not going to take them out because they're going to get lost. They're small, but they hang like this. They could be cool. And they are, here they are. They were a dollar twenty-five, and now they're a dollar twenty-eight. And I don't know where those other earrings are. And then here is, and I will look everywhere else in this box too. No, no, and no. Okay. Here are some more earrings. And they are little, the kind I like, little artsy square. It's hard to see with the glare. Come on, copper and silver. And yeah, they're going to look cute. I mean, they're cool. Let me see if I can get a better view of them without all this light, light, light. Oh, well, they look like this. So yay, you guys. And then that's it. We cleared out the box. Empty? It's empty. That was fun. What did I like the most in that? As usual, I like the blankie. And um, I like, I'm looking forward to putting on the socks. I like the ghost glass a lot. I like the gothy kind of Halloween shirt and the cow pens and the nutcracker mug and I like it all. I love it all. There's nothing that I really is it oh the ghost was kind of like a what the hell is this question mark? What the hell is this? Yeah I'm gonna say hell and how do you get it to to it's a sculpture. I don't know. Whatever. And how would you get it to even stay? Ridiculous. With that brown pumpkin. Come on. Underneath there's like a... um, It's like a... Just a ball. With like... See, for a minute I thought that was like poop or something. Because that's what it kind of looks like. It looks like a ghost pooping. And I thought, oh no, I bought another 
crude stuffed animal on accident. But, oh well, the thing, the Santa sun catcher, I have no idea. I'll have to take it out and take off the protective film and see. I'll surprise my mom and stick it up in the kitchen window at Christmas time. If it is really a sun catcher and not just a little... Okay, it is really a sun catcher and it does have decorative. It has protective film on the back that I'm going to have to get off when I take off these fingernails because I can't get that off, but it's pretty. It, it's going to be pretty. Okay, I take back everything bad that I said about it. All right, well, me and my scrabbit, my squabbit, my squirrel rabbit. I'm going to go put that over on the shelf with the good plushies, not for cats to play with. And start putting all this stuff away. And I'm missing a lot of stuff. But hopefully it's way out there and it's one of those things. I don't know, you guys. But if you watched, thank you so much for watching. And thank you for hitting the thumbs up button if you hit that. And thank you for your kind comments down below. And I, I love and appreciate you guys so much. And I wanted, want you to have like a great night. It's about to be night here. Afternoon, morning, whatever it is when you're watching this. I hope it's a good one. I hope it's a good one for me too. And we only have two more days until the weekend. Yay! So there's that. If I can just make it through tomorrow, then it'll be Friday. Okay, big hugs, big slap of kisses. And now we say goodbye. Loki's fast asleep right now. He's covered in underneath this blanket. That's cute. I wish I could show you, but I can't. All right, how do we stop this thing?